Good morning, dear friends. Here we are for another morning prayer. Good morning. My name is Shane Martin. I hope you're doing well. And today, this message to start our day is from the book Happy Life by the spiritual one of the angelists through the mediumship of Divaldo Franco. Remember all the books that we are talking about here today. I apologize for that. Um, can be found uh, for purchase in you know, major retailers. In this case, we can also go to Liao, L-E-A-L Publisher, and you can acquire the copy. It's a very small book. You can carry it with you everywhere. Anytime you need some inspiration, you can read a message to focus your mind. And as we're going to do, we're going to pray as well. Chapter 112, Joanna says, read something comforting and inspiring every day. However, breathe. Make it a habit. It will enrich you with joy, dispersing the dark clouds that may envelop you afterwards, and providing you with well-being should something unpleasant come up. Everyone needs a good counselor, and in the pages of the gospel, you'll find sure guidelines and words of wisdom for every occasion. If people would only think before acting, they would avert countless evils. Isn't that beautiful? So reading a message each and every day as we start our day is a wonderful way to persevere in the good and feel the love and vibrations of the good spirits. I'm going to invite you to join me in prayer. As always, always, broken record, close your eyes if it's safe for you to do so. And repeat the words of the prayer in your mind so we can make one petition to God instead of separate petitions. Shall we pray? Dear Mother, Father God, thank you so very much for the blessings that we have in our lives, for the beauty that surrounds us, and thank you for this blessed reincarnation. Dear God, we pray this morning that we are able to feel your loving presence in our, our lives, that we can feel the inspiration from our spirit guides who lovingly care for us. We thank them for their dedication, tolerance, and patience toward us. And we pray that we are able to be an open vessel to feel their inspiration in our lives, allowing us to help and serve one another. Dear God, today we pray for all that suffer in this world. We pray for those who suffer in their homes, either it be physical, or spiritual, or psychological suffering. We pray for those who are homeless and suffer in the streets. We pray, God, for the children who live in orphanages and foster homes. And we pray for those who are in refugee camps. Dear God, we pray. We pray for the sick who are in hospitals or suffering or are sick at home. We pray for the elderly and those with disabilities who live at nursing homes and rehabilitation places. We pray also for the caregivers of all of those who are on the earth. We pray that the spirit nurses and the spirit therapists can come to our aid that the good spirits can travel all throughout this earth, helping those who suffer, and even those who have homes and families, yet they feel disconnected from you. We pray for all of humanity in both realms of life, both on the earth and beyond all throughout the universe, 
We pray that we can all feel the loving vibrations that come from the higher spheres, soothing our souls, lessening our pain, making us stronger during our struggles so we may persevere in the good, fulfilling the tasks that you have assigned to us. Dear God, this morning we pray that we are able to visualize the good and feel the good in everything and everyone, and that we can keep our minds and hearts open to your inspiration, that we can transform the love and kindness that you have for us in actions of charity towards our fellow beings. Dear God, we pray for all, and we pray for your inspiration as we go throughout the day. And we pray for your protection, that we are able to feel supported by you. Dear God, with your permission, we end our prayer today. So be it. Dear friends, it's always an honor and a pleasure to be with you. And I hope that you can join me again. Remember, share, like, subscribe, follow, so this content can be shared with others and I hope this prayer has helped you this morning. Until I can see you again in another time, many, many blessings.